Sacros Robotics has created the unique Guardian GT robot with an exoskeleton, allowing it to move huge loads. It stands out due to its high technical specifications. The mechanoid, equipped with manipulators approximately 2 meters long, accurately replicates human movements and is equipped with a tactile feedback system. Each of its manipulators has a lifting capacity of 225 kilograms. When lifting a load weighing about 450 kilograms, the operator feels as if they are holding an object weighing no more than 2 kilograms. Through the robot's hand, the operator can feel the surrounding objects during its operation. Developers envision using this loader not only in construction and industry, but also for disaster response and hazardous environments, as the operator can be situated at a considerable distance from the worksite. Scientists from the Japanese National Institute of Advanced Industrial Science and Technology have created a construction robot that combines artificial intelligence and a sturdy body, capable of autonomous operation and heavy construction work. In the video, HPR5P is shown grabbing a sheet of drywall, lifting it, moving it, and attaching it to the wall using a power drill and screws. The robot stands at 182 centimeters tall and weighs 101 kilograms. Its parts have different degrees of freedom of movement. Cameras and sensors on the robot's head create a three-dimensional map of the surrounding space. Researchers used a neural network system and a database of images of working objects and tools to teach the robot recognition. Currently, the robot can recognize 10 types of working tools with 90% accuracy, even in poor background and lighting conditions. ACE notes that Japan is expected to face a serious shortage of manual labor in many industrial sectors in the future. Robots will help address this issue and can replace humans in heavy tasks such as aircraft and ship assembly. The Hadrian X bricklaying robot by Fastbrick Robotics has set a record for wall construction speed. This advanced robot simply drives to the construction site, extends its 32-meter-long boom, and accurately lays up to 300 large stone blocks per hour. If it works with the largest 45-kilogram blocks, it can lay a vertical wall of 70 square meters in an hour, meaning it can construct a wall the size of a tennis court in just four hours. And this is not the limit. The creators plan to increase the speed to 500 blocks per hour. The system uses construction adhesive, which is stronger than mortar and dries within 45 minutes. A Husqvarna DXR is the ideal machine for demolition of partial structures, such as pipes, staircases, and ceilings, where high precision is needed to avoid damaging the remaining structures. The DXR robot can help overcome hazardous operating conditions. Collapse risks, smoke, dust, heat, or vibrations are no longer a real issue with the operator being able to perform the job from a real distance. Thanks to the smart, compact design, the machine can easily get through small openings or be lowered into narrow shafts to perform tasks efficiently. It is also suitable for a wide range of tasks such as delining, dismantling, and even forklift operation. With its direct exhaust-free electric motor, low weight and compact dimensions, the DXR is ideal for dismantling work indoors or in sensitive areas such as hotels, hospitals, or laboratories. The Spot Robot provides a solution for data collection to document progress and executive states, freeing site managers and enabling data-driven decision-making. Spot can autonomously navigate construction environments, automating applications like Reality Capture on the job site and site documentation. Spot's agility and athletic intelligence mean it can move through job sites like other robots can't. Equipped with a laser scanner, Spot programs routine scanning routes to gather high-precision 3D data on construction progress. Frequently captured site images can be contextualized in construction documentation used for automating on-site analysis and reporting through cutting-edge artificial intelligence technologies. Moreover, despite construction sites being hazardous places, the robot can adeptly navigate stairs and other obstacles on its four legs, operating in semi-autonomous mode or being controlled remotely. German company Kalamix is renowned for the best construction equipment for mixing a wide variety of mortars. The logical next step was the creation of a rapid application system for mortar when laying wall blocks. It is impossible to apply an even layer of mortar with a traditional trowel in one stroke. Kalamix Masonry System is a compact robotic mechanical unit capable of covering perfectly smooth strips of building solution on a wall surface several meters long in a single pass. The device's mechanism allows adjusting the thickness of the applied mortar. Thanks to interchangeable attachments, the mortar can be applied in a continuous strip or in a patterned manner, essential for installing different types of block materials. 
Okibo is developing intelligent, mobile, multi-purpose, and autonomous robots for use in construction sites. The company's first product is a robot for wall rendering that will be used to simplify and lower costs of handling wall isolation. Okibo robots are mounted on a highly mobile platform and use advanced computer vision, laser detectors, geopositioning, and inertial motion sensors to operate and adapt to any construction site. The robot's versatile robotic manipulators enable the programming of a multitude of tasks that are today performed by manual labor or limited machinery. Using a novel 3D scanning method, Okibo robot is capable of 3D mapping its environment, enabling progress monitoring and reliable understanding of the plastering requirements. The robot will also be able to accurately determine the area to be applied, pre-plan the work path, and apply the material autonomously, accurately, and quickly. The Canvas company has introduced a robot for finishing walls in construction. The robot created using artificial intelligence is a four-wheeled platform equipped with laser scanners and a manipulator arm. It scans unfinished walls and autonomously completes their finishing. A human is needed to supply construction materials to the robot and replace working components, but the robot's labor productivity is significantly higher than that of a human. The construction robot was used for finishing work at the Harvey Milk Terminal 1 in San Francisco Airport. Experts evaluated the robot's high efficiency and recognized the potential of this project. Its use reduces construction timelines and the number of workers required on the site, as it eliminates the need for a labor crew. According to our calculations, a two-story house with dimensions of 15 by 15 meters can be constructed by the robotic system in a week, experts stated. French architect Stephanie Chaltiel offers a new fast and cost-effective method for building temporary shelters that combines ancient construction techniques with modern technology involving drones that spray clay. The structure consists of a wooden dome-shaped framework with attached hay-filled bags. The top of the structure is coated with a mixture of clay and plant fiber using drones connected to a pump. This mixture bonds the construction elements, making the structure strong, durable, and weather-resistant. The prototype called Mudshell was unveiled at the recent London Design Festival. If Chaltiel's team had attempted to manually apply clay to the London Dome, the task would have taken several weeks. The drone completed it in a matter of minutes. Write in the comments which of these construction robots you like the most. If you found something new and interesting in this video, don't forget to like it and subscribe to the Caro Show channel. See you soon.